Listen to the heart of true love. True love is not something one does. It is not something one has. It is not a thing. It is not an action. It is not even a feeling. It is the cause. There is no strife in true love. It is always at ease. Listen to the heart of true love. The true lover knows herself. She doesn't try to convince others. She is content with herself. She doesn't need the approval of others because she accepts herself. The whole world accepts her. She doesn't think of herself as superior because she knows herself as a conduit rather than a cause. She is generous and graciously attracts opportunities to be of service. She doesn't care to possess anything or anyone because she knows she already belongs to everything and everyone. Listen to the heart of true love. When the true lover runs into difficulty, she stops and gives herself to it. She doesn't focus on her own comfort. Thus, problems are really no problem to her. Listen to the heart of true love. Love is equally available to the good and to the bad person, but to different effects. Love is an inexhaustible treasure to the good person. No matter how lavishly it is bestowed, there is always more. Love is a refuge to the bad person. It doesn't judge and endlessly offers yet another chance. Listen to the heart of true love. Love is the mother. It is also the child. As the mother, love gives birth to all things, nourishes and cares for them, comforts and protects them, guides and cherishes them. As the child, love springs forth into life, unconscious and perfect. Love takes on a body, grows into fullness, recognizes itself, and returns to its source, only to become one. Listen to the heart of true love. Definitions cannot circumscribe love. We cannot say directly. Love both surrounds and pervades everything. It existed before the universe was born. Love is before everything. Everything is born of love. Love is the heart of all things. It is so common. Listen to the heart of true love. Love alone endures. Eventually all things, all experience, all memory vanish into it. It is formless and perfect. It is serene, unchanging, infinite and eternally present. It nourishes worlds both, visible 
and invisible, yet makes no claim upon them. It existed before all names, but we call it love. It is pure mystery. Listen to the heart of true love. Love, as the great mother, gives birth to infinite worlds. The more it is used, the more it produces. It is inexhaustible. You can use it in any way you please. It can only be found within yourself. Surrender and love will come of its own accord. Listen to the heart of true love. The true lover is the greatest servant. She is available to all people and doesn't reject anyone. She is ready to make use of any situation and doesn't waste anything. She has no fixed plans and desires no specific outcome. She follows her intuition. Free from concepts, she is truly useful and valuable. Listen to the heart of true love. Because she is so rich and her treasure so valuable, the true lover takes great pleasure in sharing her bounty. The more she does for others, the happier she is. The more she gives to others, the wealthier she is. The true lover carefully fulfills her own responsibility and corrects her own mistakes. By demanding nothing of others, she is never in lack. Listen to the heart of true love. Love is a flow which must constantly be given away. Its source is a mystery because she knows that there is no end to her treasure. The lover can keep giving without expecting return. She is free. Listen to the heart of true love. What a mystery, the beneficence of the lover. She holds no concern for wealth, yet the people around her prosper. She finds no need to conform to religion or philosophy, yet the people around her become serene. She gives little attention to issues of the common good, Yet the good becomes as common as water. She simply lives for love. And love encompasses and sustains all. Listen to the heart of true love. The true lover is like the newborn child. Her spirit is forever fresh. She doesn't worry. She's unaware of herself and acts without thinking. She lets things come and go effortlessly. She's in love with the world, but doesn't know why. She constantly explores but doesn't expect to find anything. Listen, 
Listen to the heart of true love. There is nothing more enduring than true love. She who fully embraces love will likewise endure. Her name will be honored for generations. Her effect will continue forever.